second. <gasps> uh, how did the wasp move? The, I swear, guys, the wasp is a ghost. <sighs> My window is not open. My window is not open, and that wasp just turned over as I was talking to you guys. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I just need to throw this this dead bug out from my room because I swear it's a demon wasp. It looks like it's alive again. I don't know what to do. Okay, all right, so you're dead and I'm gonna poke you again. You should be dead. You are dead, you are dead, so why are you moving? Dead wasp. Hey everybody, so it's time for another face off. This time it's gonna be between something I already subscribed to versus a company that sent me something for free. We're gonna see what happens. I did this with the sock bun versus the hair donut, but I'm much more excited for this one because the stakes are much higher and it's the December box, which usually is a really good box. So we're gonna see. First package that came in the mail. Ipsy. Second package that came in the mail, Starlux. Starlux was sent to me for free. I have no idea what's gonna be in here. The thing about Starlux is that they never got me to take a quiz, so I think they just guessed what I would like, or I don't know if it's just like a regulated thing that they send out to people. Both are $15 per month. I got it wrong in my other video when I was talking about Ipsy. I thought it was 10 for some reason, but I'm paying 15 for it. Not 10. But anyway, let's start off with what we know. Let's go with Ipsy. This is gonna be a throw down. Whoa, okay. Oh man, I like this a lot. Okay, this is Ipsy's bag that it comes in. This is actually really nice. I like this a lot. It's just like a coated, good quality bag, holy. And it comes with this little dangly thing that says Ipsy, see that? Huh, cool, okay. So let's see what the first thing in the bag is. Ooh, it's NYX, okay, okay. And it is fusion. Oh, it's lipstick. Whoa! This is a bright purple. All right, it's more like a fuchsia, actually. All right, so that's cool. I'm, I'm probably never gonna wear it. All right, next thing in the box. Not for resale, once again. Okay, this is called Be a Bombshell, the one stick in flustered. That's what it's called, see that? Whoa, okay. So this is a semi-sparkly, do you guys see this? I don't know if you can tell. I might just be picking up the sparkles on my nails right now. It does have some shimmer in it, see that? And this is a stick, I guess it's for like, oh, okay, I got that on my nose. But let's swatch this as well. Woo, that is creamy. All right, so that's the thing at the top. I'll probably use that actually, probably for my cheeks. Uh, maybe not so much for my lips, because I'm not usually a red lip person, but since I have so many colorful things coming my way for the lips, maybe I will try it out. I don't know. All right, next thing in the bag is Signature by English Laundry. Whoa, I thought it was gonna be soap. I was ready to be disappointed. Ooh, I got some perfume samples up in here. That smells nice. Holy, I can smell these already without even opening them. Okay. I like that smell, actually. Okay, and this one's for the man. It smells like paint. Am I going crazy? Okay, no, that actually smells really good. I wish I had a guy to give this to. All right, next one in the bag is a red nail polish. Ooh, that's nice. I don't really have much red nail polish. Okay, and last one in here is an eyeshadow palette. Ooh, okay, that's nice. How do I open this? This palette has a white, gray, and like really dark gray, almost black eyeshadow. So let's just swatch these up. Here are the three colors. And I barely did any, like I only did like two swipes for each one. That's quite pigmented. I actually really like that. And that's by Pop Beauty. I've heard of them before. I don't know where I've seen them before, but I've heard of them somewhere. All right, that's it for the Ipsy bag. Um, to be honest, not as good as last month. Last month's still the best. Out of the whole bag, I like the eyeshadow and the actual bag the best. Now it's time for our next contender, Star Looks. Okay, so it doesn't come in a bag, it comes in a box that's wrapped actually really nicely. And it says Star Looks and has, you know, this, and then it's tied in the back like that, so I guess it's just an elastic. So I haven't even seen what's inside yet, but it comes with this nice wrapping paper. Oh, 
Oh, it's a makeup brand. Way for me to even realize that. What is Starbox? The most innovative beauty subscription box that exists. For only $15 a month plus shipping, Starlook sends you three to four fashion forecasted full size pro quality cosmetics valued at $35 to $99 from the newest pro cosmetic line in the industry. If you like Birchbox, Beauty Army, etc., you will love Starbox, even though it's completely different from other beauty box brands. Okay. Good to know. If you know makeup, you'll love star looks. 100% cruelty free. That's always really important. That's awesome. Okay, so this is what the box looks like when I open it up. Let's start off with a thing I can see, which is awesome because it is clearly a liner brush. And this is actually really nice. My liner brush is from Sigma. Um, it's handy dandy. I use it for my eyeliner every single day. Um, you can never have enough makeup brushes though, I don't think. And this is what it looks like. It's very thin. It's even thinner than the one I have, which is phenomenal. And it feels really good. Like this is packed in here. It's not going anywhere. It's good quality. Oh good. I don't have one of these. It comes with a sharpener. There's a tiny box. It's infinity eyeliner. You guys know how much I love my casual liner because it's super duper creamy. So let's just open this up. Okay. If it's gel liner, you've won me over. It's blue. Whoa. I'm gonna have a lot of fun with this. This is a dark blue, almost navy, but not quite, um, gel liner. Holy moly. Okay, I've just dipped it in. Wow, look at that color. Holy mackerel. I could use this as a base. Okay, I like this a lot. Like this is, I just blended that out and it still looks like that. So far it's holding up to its pro quality promise, that's for sure. All right, and the final thing in the box is this, and I can see from the back, it says it's a five shade shadow. That is awesome. I'm excited to see what shadows are in here. All right, this is what the front of the palette looks like. Okay, first of all, I applaud Star Looks for having a red eyeshadow because it's almost impossible to have a red eyeshadow. As far as I know, MAC is the only one who successfully pulled off a red eyeshadow. But look at this. The reason they don't really exist is because the red eyeshadow pigment or whatever it is that makes it red is really bad for your eyes. So it's hard, I guess, for them to formulate an eye safe red eyeshadow. Okay, so the red isn't quite a red so much as it's an orangey red. Okay, so here's my honest opinion. The white, it's a little bit chalky. It's still nice. It's not as opaque as the other ones. Like I had to do a couple of swipes, a little bit chalky, but it's still good. Like I'm still definitely gonna use this. So this is what these look like. Gold, reddish orange, blue, taupe, white. So you see how unbelievably pigmented these are, which is phenomenal. So yeah, even though I got the Star Looks box for free, they still win because Ipsy's was good, like the eyeshadow from Ipsy I'm really excited about, blah, blah, blah. But honestly, the Star Looks box gave me all full-size products and it costs the same and you get actual like legit makeup that you can count on. So that's exciting. And I'm not saying this because I got it for free. In a face-off, the way that I determine if something wins over the other thing is which one am I gonna use more? And this, with the Star Looks box, I'm going to use every single product I got. With the Ipsy one, I'm definitely not going to use the purple lipstick, um, though that's probably going to look good on a lot of other people who get Ipsy. And I'm just not as excited about the stuff that I got from Ipsy as I am with Star Looks this month. If you want to subscribe to Star Looks, I'll have the link for it in the Wonder Bar as well as Ipsy so you can make an informed decision. Let me know what else you want me to face off against each other in the comments down below. It could be anything. It could be high end versus low end. It could be drugstore versus drugstore. Anything you want because I love doing face offs. Like they're my favorite video to do for you guys. All links will be in the Wonder Bar as you guys know. If I don't see you before Christmas, Merry Christmas and I'll see you guys super soon. All right, love you. Bye. Let the night come.